Hi, this is Ivan, and I'm going to show you how to use Dial Caller. Uh, the first thing you got to do is enter your your username and password right here, which you should have those details with you already. Uh, and then you're going to click on Sign In. Then it's going to take you to your account dashboard. So this is what's going to allow people to basically call you. So you have an assigned number. So this is your assigned number. Every time you're calling out, this is the number that's going to appear that's calling. So from that's why you need to call from here. So if you go here to the right-hand corner where there's the little phone icon, you click on it, and the dial pad is going to show up. Make sure that you don't dial with your mouse pad. So you don't want to dial the numbers like right here. You've got to dial them using your keyboard, your number keyboard. So all you got to do is, is put your cursor right here on the number, where's this number up here. And then with your keyboard, you're going to enter the phone number. You always got to make sure you enter a one first before the area code in the number. So, for example, um, if I want to dial, let's see. So, for example, if I want to dial a number, let's say um, this one, I got to dial one and then the area code 714. And then two or three to two six seven. So you always got to put the number one in front of all the numbers, and then, then now you can use your uh, mouse and just click on the call button right here, the green button. You click on it, and you're gonna hear that it's calling. It's gonna say call established. Thank you right for here. calling French County Trust Head House Fire. Your call See? will be answered shortly. So it called the number. So then I just want to end it right there. So that's a very simple way to use this dial caller. And that way when you're calling from wherever you are, um, this is the phone number right here that's going to show up that you're calling from, which is basically this one right here. So that's all you got to do to be able to make calls. And uh, if somebody calls this number back, so... Uh, if for any reason you need to give out the number so they can call you back uh, to make the appointments, then they can call you to this number, and I'm going to forward this number to your number that you want it to ring on. So whatever number you want me uh, to forward it, um, I'm going to put that number so that way they, when they call this number, it gets forwarded to your number and you're able to answer that call. Um, again, there's also the recording section, so every time somebody calls you, uh, the calls are going to be here. Uh, you're going to click on voicemail, so they leave you a voicemail. The car recording is going to be here, so whatever voicemail they left, there's a voicemail. Or if we got forwarded, every call is going to get recorded that comes back in into this line. And then you're not going to see it here, but uh, it doesn't give you a report of the car tracking. But I I get a back uh, a back end log of all the calls that you made um, on my end. You're not gonna see it here. I don't think it has a call log. No, it doesn't have one. But um, I am gonna be able to see on my end uh, the dial caller actually sends me since I own this number. It sends me a, a call log of everything, all the calls that you made that day or every single day. So that's how you got to do it to use the number and to be able to call out. If you have any questions, feel free to give me a call. And um, yeah, let me know or send me an email and get in touch with me as soon as possible. Thank you.